TSA workers at airports across the country are already working in high-pressure jobs. If the government shuts down, they'll be required to keep showing up for those jobs, but their paychecks will not be showing up. I honestly believe that it will be a public safety issue um, to work without a paycheck, um, high stress, um, you know, it would affect the, the, the workers mentally, I feel. Alicia Dalford represents the nearly 700 TSA workers here at Reagan National Airport. TSA workers are among the thousands of federal workers the government classifies as essential, meaning they must continue to show up for work during the shutdown. In past shutdowns, federal workers eventually got their back pay, but Dalford says after the 2018 shutdown, it took months. It was very uh, stressful. It was high stress. Um, we were sent a letter home uh, for creditors to give to our creditors. It took over over two months. Everett Kelly represents more than 700,000 federal workers across the country who may be faced with no paycheck. Some of them are going to go hungry without a paycheck. Some of them are going to miss a house note without a paycheck. Some of them are not going to be able to pay uh, uh, child care. Despite the looming deadline, Kelly remains optimistic. I, I remain hopeful, okay? Uh, it's devastating. It's, it's, it's a sad thought to even think uh, that the government will shut down, you know, especially in times like this. Mark Seagraves, News 4.